Hey guys, welcome back. And today we are on Farming 2 Max episode 35. Well, all the way up to episode 35. I just don't know when the series is going to end, guys. Every single update, they add new stuff to the game, making it much, much harder for us to ever reach a fully max base. But don't worry, guys. We will push and we will get it. So, guys, we're going to start off this video actually by upgrading a few things. If we go in our clan castle and collect our treasure, as you guys can see, we got some uh, nice resources. One million of each resources, along with 5,000 our clans are pretty good there. So we're actually going to upgrade our archer tower, our brand new archer tower, up to level 12. It is almost up to our uh, max level of level 13, like the other archer tower. So we're going to upgrade this in 3, 2, 1, boom! There it is, 6.5 million gold down the drain. And now we have 4 million elixirs, so we're actually going to come down here. As you guys can see, we have 1 level 12 barrack, 1 level 11, another level 11, and a level 10. So we're actually going to upgrade our uh, level 10 barrack, get this bad boy up to level 11. So yeah, guys, so we are going to upgrade this for 3 million elixir in 3, 2, 1, and boom! There goes 3 million elixir and an 8-day upgrade on our barracks. So yeah guys, so that's it for the upgrades for today, as you guys can see I'm obviously out of research, so today we're gonna go into the Masters League, find a base, and I'll see you guys when we got a solid base to attack. Alrighty guys, so for this first attack here, I am attacking D4CNY, and D4CNY here is just loaded on loot, uh, love to see these bases, 4,000 Dark Elixir, along with 300,000 of each resource. And also should definitely be able to get the one star. So uh, yeah, guys. So let's come in from this bottom seat here. Just two finger deployment with the barbarians and archers. No need for anything more on a base this level and this setup. All right. So uh, I think we got the bottom here. Now let's start coming in from the top right side. Uh, there is actually an eagle on this base, but it is dead. So that's nice. Uh, love seeing dead eagles, you know. Makes my life as a farmer a lot easier. And I'm sure it makes your lives a lot better. Two. All right, so 33% right now. Uh, looking good on the 50. Just gotta grab these last like two collectors and the dark elixir, and then just drop our arch queen. We should easily be able to get this 50%. All right, so I think that air sweepers are like two hit points. So if we could just get one shot off, yeah, there we go. All right, so 41% right now. No clan castle or anything on this base since it is obviously very very dead. All right, so uh, 44%. Uh, I think we get up to 45, 46. So let's just drop the rest of our troops over here. Try and get this eagle artillery down as well with the 50, so that we can get like that, you know, that kill for the statistics here. All right, so 48% right now. Archer queen, come on. Oh, I don't know. No, that's only three blocks. So Archer queen should be able to reach it. Okay. Come on, come on. If we can get it. All right, one, two, three. There we go. All right, so we'll end off the battle there. 300,000, 350,000 gold, 377,000 elixir, 4,050 dark elixir. Definitely awesome, awesome loot there. So, guys, I'm gonna, I am going to go head back to base, cook up another barge army as usual, and I'll see you guys for our second attack. Alrighty, guys. So, for attack number two here, I found a Goron. And uh, Goran, Goran, however you want to pronounce that name, uh, is actually a pretty solid base. Again, this base is worth about 300,000 of each resource, along with several thousand Dark Elixir, so definitely some pretty nice resources here. So let's attack this base. Now, this base is actually a little different than the other base, uh, due to the fact that this base is actually not that inactive. Uh, Eagle Artillery is still alive, Grand, uh, like Inferno stuff, juicing them, and uh, that Inferno is going to be very annoying. Uh, yeah, so uh, this base uh, will actually be harder probably to get the 50, but it should not be impossible. I think we should still be able to get it here, and uh, obviously that Eagle Artillery going to do some serious damage, so we want to take that out as soon as we can. Alrighty, uh, let's just get that gold mine. Let's try and get these elixir pumps here. 36% right now. Eagle artillery has gone down. That is good. Alright, let's drop our clan castle here. I don't know what we have. Oh, a dragon and some hog riders. Alrighty, that'll that'll do good. Uh, we do also have our barbarian king, guys. I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to get this 50, to be honest. Uh, Alright, let's drop our barbarian king over here. We'll, we'll use... The bar bringing and Arch Queen's ability at simultaneously here. That's the 50. Let's end off the battle there. Walk away with 300,000 gold, or almost 200,000 gold, 300,000 elixir, and 2,000 
700 Dark Elixir. Now, that is some serious resources. So, yeah, guys, hopefully we'll have the same exact luck in our next raid. I'm going to go back and cook up another army. And I'll see you guys for our third and final attack. Alrighty, guys. So, for this final attack here, as you guys can see, I found a big E. Now, Big E isn't a base that I'd usually attack, but obviously, since it is the last attack of the day, you guys know how I do. You guys know I love to just go full out on a base. We're going to go full out on a Big E here. So, let's do this right. So, I think we're going to come in from this top left side. I would come in from this top, from this, like, bottom right, which is what I prefer. But there's actually just a ton of, uh, you know, like, structures down there that I really just rather not bother with. I'd rather just get straight to these storages. And, you know, maybe even if we can, three-star this base. All right, so let's come in from this side here. We're going to drop a jump spell right there. I don't know how this is going to go. I usually don't attack like this. But, you know, yeah, all right. So two giant bombs have gone off. That's just perfect. We'll drop our Branking and Archer Queen here. We will drop the rest of our Archers to Finger Deployment as usual. Uh... Alright, so let's drop a heal spell. Let's drop a rage spell. We still have like 14 archers. Let's just drop them on the outside. Alright, Archer Queen is going around. That is just not good. Uh, we'll drop another rage spell with the Barbarian King since they are uh, are going in the center. Barbarian King will get the Town Hall, it looks like, but I don't think he's going to get much further. Archer Queen is going around the outside right now. Uh, not looking too great. If the troops stayed together, I think we might have had a shot at three here, but... Uh, Dang, alright, a giant bomb just took out basically all of our archers. Uh, Barbarian King is going down to that single inferno. We still have the Arch Queen alive at full health, but uh, I don't think he's going to get much more than a, that elixir storage. And uh, yeah, guys, so I think that's basically it for this raid. We will let it play out, though, see how far we can get into this base. I think we, you know, we might be able to get up to like 60, 65%. If the Arch Queen can uh, do good for us, uh, I don't know, though. Uh... Alright, we're going to have to use her ability right now. I didn't realize that there are actually a lot of defenses uh, towards this bottom. So, yeah, I think the Arch Queen's going to go down now, sadly. At about, uh, actually, ooh, she's going to get us that gold storage, though. That's nice. Doing, like, 10,000 gold per shot. That is very, very cool there. Up to 58% right now. The more percentage, the more loot bonus. So, uh, yeah, alright. So, I think this cannon's going to take her out. Oh, no, the skeletons are going to take her out. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, she's living. Uh, but that mortar, alright, so yeah, that's gonna end off the raid, they're pretty solid 2-star, and we actually get the least amount of loot out of the other, of all 3 raids today, using 5 spells, uh, wow, alright, well, uh, thank you guys so much for watching, make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, make sure to like the video if you guys enjoyed at any point, make sure you guys subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys tomorrow, so peace out, and as always, clash on!